I believe that people should not be divided, uh, the, the youngsters, the adolescents, and finally the, the mature young adults, and then the older folks are all divided people. When you get to be 65, you don't want to travel on an ocean liner with old folks. How come we put up these buildings for the old folks? We think that people ought to live wherever the hell they want to live. That cities must be designed so we have an integrated, intelligent society. Uh, Einstein, when he was 65, 70 years old, he would talk to youngsters. He kept reading. He kept up with ideas. Why must societies be divided into different groups? We think that you're as young as, you, uh, as your life permits you to be, as your exposure, as your ideas. All right. This is what it looks like, a future where technology is harnessed for all and money has no relevance. It's called the Venus Project, and he says 50 million people around the world are now involved or aware of it. Pour cela, sachez-le, the Venus Project, le projet Venus. El proyecto Venus comenzó al industrias que genial at Jacques Fresco. You may not have heard of Jacques Fresco, but he is known around the world. Documentaries have been done about him. Magazine writers from Europe have written stories about him. A resource-based economy states that if you declare the Earth and all its resources as the common heritage of all of the world's people, there's no need for armies, navies, police, prisons. None of that's necessary if people have access to their needs. Now, we'll start with this, and you tell me... I'll try to point it out. Yeah, you can point right at it. The center of a city, the nucleus, will house an electronic computer. The computers do not control people. All the machines do is control the physical entities that comprise the environment. You can't be human or decent without the knowledge to overcome scarcity.